Hello friends, are you ready for some freakily, spookily paranormal videos? I am too, so let's check out Nuke's top 5. As always, I put a link in the description. I put a link in the description for the original video. Go over to Nuke's top 5, show him your support, leave a like and subscribe. Now let's check out his video. They're always good. Nukes top five. Tunnel vision. This next video was sent in to popular Japanese ghost hunting team Clip Store by a man who claims that the footage was recorded by his now deceased older brother. The man says oh. that his brother was a big fan of the paranormal and often spent his free time exploring well-known ghost spots in Japan. So one day his brother decides to film an allegedly haunted tunnel somewhere in Fukuoka Prefecture, Japan. He has an encounter that is absolutely terrifying. Let's check it out. I heard that. Did you hear it? Oh, run! Oh, there was a shadow creep! Did you see it? Yeah. After the man hears a creepy unexplained voice coming from right behind him, he quickly spins around to see an ominous dark Holy figure standing poster, man. right in front of him. A shadowy shape that had not been there only seconds before. It wasn't. Absolutely terrified, the man makes a run for it. But the story gets even weirder. Because a few weeks later, the man who recorded this video passed away in a freak accident. This horrifying video was found That's on sad. the man's phone. It was the last video that he recorded before his death. Oh. So the clip store team... Could it be related to this incident that he died in a freak accident? That's terrifying, man. Tracks down the location but they don't really find anything unusual during their investigation. So could it be that the man accidentally recorded real paranormal phenomena? And could this have somehow led to him losing his life in such a tragic way? Oh man. Let me know. That's sad. The Viaduct Tavern. Paranormal investigators Jeff, Phil, and Mark from the YouTube channel Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations recently investigated the notoriously haunted Viaduct Tavern in London. The viaduct has been around for hundreds of years and was built just a few yards away from the site of the infamous Old Newgate Prison, where thousands of criminals were executed. The tavern's third floor was once a brothel where a lady of the night named Kate tragically lost her life. With such a long and dark history, it's no wonder that over the years, landlords, workers, and even visitors have witnessed terrifying paranormal activity. Nevertheless, the tavern has become a very popular local historical pub. The Ghost Tech team sets up several static cameras and begin their investigation on the third floor, where most of the supernatural activity has been witnessed. It doesn't take long before the three investigators start to hear very strange sounds coming from the floor right above their heads. Let's check it out. Oh, I hear the footsteps, man. Hello? Hello? I can hear you. Someone's downright walking up there, man. I can hear you walking. There was a few footsteps. Yeah. On the floor above us. We heard it. As I stand on the stairs to the full floor, I hear footsteps above me on the floorboards. Here is the audio taken from Static Cam 5, which is located up on the fourth floor. She should hear it better. Oh. 
The creepy sound of someone walking can be heard That's on the creepy. fourth floor of the Viaduct Tavern. The Ghost Tech team believes that they might be making contact with the spirit of Kate, the lady of the night that tragically passed away there long ago. Jeff, Phil, and Mark head up to the fourth floor to do a spirit box session. And what happens next is downright creepy. If I knew your full name, I could look in the newspapers the old newspapers and find out what happened to the person that did that terrible thing to you. That's all I need from you is your surname. So if I hold this oh. out... Oh! Guys. Did yeah. you effing see yeah. that, man? It's a shadow creep! Something's in that room. It just went past the window, and I've got it on film. Something went across that window. Kate? While asking questions, Jeff captures a dark figure quickly moving in front of a oh. window. Not and once. it moves so fast as well. That creeps me the F out, you know? Superhuman speed! The ghost. But twice. Jeff immediately alerts the team of what he's captured, but they can't find any explanation for the bizarre encounter. And that isn't the only time the team captures something unexplainable that night. Back on the third floor, the three investigators begin to hear strange disembodied voices. And then this happens. There you go. That's what I was hearing Shh. downstairs. Kate, tell me your name, your full name. <laughs> Kate, tell me your name. <laughs> tell me your name, Kate. We can find out. Find out what happened to you and whether the person that did it was caught and punished. There was someone stood by me. What's going on? Okay. There was someone stood by, by me then. Oh, hang on a minute. That is the clearest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay, calm down. Did you get it on camera? Mark nearly jumps out of his skin as he sees someone standing right next to him. But when they look, there's no one there. No. However, when the ghost team reviews their recorded footage later, they realized that Mark actually did capture what he saw on camera. Let's now see he it. can only be seen for a split second when slowing down the footage, but as Mark spins around, the unexplained face of someone oh. can be seen standing right next to him. So could this be the Ooh, ghost of Kate, the lady you, of the night who tragically lost her life inside the tavern? Or could it be the spirits of prisoners who were executed where the tavern Holy now stands? Moly. You decide. You can watch this entire investigation over on the YouTube channel, Ghost Tech Paranormal Investigations. I will. You should too. In Kanto. But maybe we now have Ghost seen Hunter all the best Idol bits. from the YouTube channel Ghost23 sets out to explore a remote waterfall in the middle of nowhere and surrounded by tall mountains. Idol has been told that the waterfall is haunted by an environmental spirit known as an Encanto, a mythical being that has the ability to appear in human form. Idol is completely alone as he makes the difficult climb up the waterfall with nothing but a camera. The sun is setting fast and with very little daylight left, Idol captures something truly chilling. Something that makes him run. Who are you, man? Oh, he's walking towards him. No. That could be a person, yeah? Right?
Sino ba kayo? Hello? Hello? Sino yung nagpapagita dito? A mysterious figure appears to be watching Idol as he's exploring and recording footage of the waterfall. The person then just walks away, disappearing into thin air. Now there is nowhere for this figure to have disappeared to. This really? It's a big ass forest, yeah, he could disappear into. Right? Or is this like rocks or something? There is a steep drop below and a tall, unclimbable cliff oh. above. Idol is baffled and confused by what he just saw and can't find anywhere that the mysterious being could have went. That's it's crazy, almost man. As if it walked right into the waterfalls surrounding the mountain. So could this be the Encanto that is said to appear at the waterfall? Maybe. Or something else? Tell me what you think. Oh, that's creepy, a cry man. For help. This next video is a bit of a mystery, as it was reposted to TikTok without a source or information. The video shows CCTV footage of a young girl as she walks around her home. What happens next is like something from a nightmare. That could be a draft, yeah? Now she can't open the door. Is that the light flickering as well, man? What the heck, man? Holy air fryer, man. What's going on, man? Lights suddenly begin to flicker, startling the young girl as she rushes for the door. But the door won't open. That's as terrifying, she slams on the man. Crying out for help, an ominous dark shape can be seen slowly moving towards her. One dark edge reaching out, almost like an arm ready to grab her. Holy That's when crap. someone, presumably her brother, comes to her rescue and opens the door for her to escape. Now, without a source, we'll probably never know what happened here. Oh. So, I ask you, is it real, or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. An, an elaborate hoax? That's a little girl, man. Off the rails. Stephen Kerner is out on a drive through the countryside of Minnesota when he spots something very odd. Oh boy. Oh boy. What uh Well that ain't good. <laughs> There's no one driving it. Don't know who's running that, but <laughs> I mean yeah, okay. A small empty train car with an empty caboose slowly <laughs> moves along the track, even though no one is driving it. Steven is a little confused by what he just witnessed, but he just shrugs it off and drives away. Yeah, of course, someone could have started it and left, you know? But after posting his bizarre encounter on TikTok, someone spots something that Steven didn't see. Oh. Not, but I mean, yeah, okay. What was it? <laughs> Please tell me I'm not the only one who saw that. This thing, right here. Oh. What the f is that? Viewers are freaked I don't out know. when they see an odd pale figure seemingly hanging out of the back of the train. Many believe the tiny what locomotive the to be man? a ghost train. And some believe that the train might be haunted by a spirit. And others just think it's a very odd occurrence paired with pareidolia. But maybe what it do is, you think this maybe it is, is. Pareidolia, but... Let me know 
down in the comments. A rough ride. Could it be Pardolia? Tiktok user Jose Castillo and his friends often mountain bike after work on some wooded trails near the city of Oaxaca, Mexico. One evening after dark, Jose and his friends go out on a trail that they've taken many times before. But this time, things take a terrifying turn. Jose's GoPro camera is recording when something happens that still gives him chills to this day. Oh, we've seen this. Yeah? Did you see it? Yeah. Someone or something appears out of nowhere and Jose barely manages to swerve around it. When slowed down... We saw that in yesterday's video. <laughs> ...down and paused, the figure appears to be cloaked, wearing a veil that's translucent enough that you can but still see what creepy looks as F. like a face. A very oh. disturbing face. Many viewers of Jose's TikTok believe that he captured the infamous weeping woman, La Llorona, a vengeful spirit of Mexican lore that mourns the loss of her children. But what do you think this is? Know. Let me know. Something very creepy. That's what I think Exploration it is. Exploration gone wrong. Two friends decide to explore an abandoned industrial park at an undisclosed location in China. The site has been abandoned for over three years, and most of the entrances have been locked shut to prevent intruders and squatters. But this doesn't stop the two explorers as they manage to find a way inside. Okay. Okay, okay. They start to explore the construction floor by floor. That's when they spot something absolutely unnerving. And now it's gone. Did you see it? The shadow creep. Did you see it? Yeah, I did Someone see Someone appears it. to be sitting on a chair inside one of the empty offices. The cameraman calls out to his friend and they quickly turn back and check out the room. What the f Holy spatula fork and knife. There's nowhere, there's nowhere it could have run to, you know? And there was no cut in the video. But there's no one there. Look, there's no cut in the video. Ha 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 So did they accidentally capture a paranormal event? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. Holy moly. Unwanted guest. In this next creepy video, two police officers are alerted by an Airbnb homeowner who suspects someone has broken into her house. How's it going? What, what seems to be the problem? I, I left for a while to go shopping and when I came home, the door is open. I think somebody broke in. The homeowner says the house should be empty but is worried that an intruder might be inside. The two officers make their way into the house as their body cameras record the entire incident. Police, if anyone's here, make yourself known. And if it is caught, on police camera, then it is 100% legit. Why would the police waste time on making paranormal videos, you know? One of the officers is checking out the downstairs bedroom, and this is when things start to get weird. Hello? Hello? Anyone inside? And that radio interference came just as they heard the bang, you know?
There's no one there. A loud bang can be heard and at the same time strange interference comes through the radio. Yeah. The officer now heads upstairs and his body cam starts to experience strange video glitches. What happens next is downright chilling. Let's check it out. This is gonna be good, man. Police! Anyone inside, make yourself known. There's no one there, man. This camera is freaking out as well. This is legit, man. I tell you, this is... This is legit. Oh, oh, oh. Police officer or not, I would get the F out of there, man. In a jiffy. No one in there. Downstairs, clear. What? Holy Moses. Someone kept charging at him. This is freaking me the F out, man. Upstairs clear? Yeah. No, it's we're, not. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> now, understandably, this police officer is done with this house. Yeah. Two doors open on their own without explanation, and when the officer is yeah, about to clear. go downstairs, I'm out of here. the loud sound of charging <laughs> footsteps or stomping can be heard right behind him. Holy he swings crap, around, but again, man. no one there. This footage was later released as the officer claimed to have experienced paranormal activity while inside the house. So just what do you think is going on here? Is this Airbnb haunted? Let me know yep. down in the comments. Definitely haunted. An odd intruder. A woman in Jamaica steps outside to retrieve something from her car, but she doesn't know that an absolutely chilling event is about to occur. Oh. Oh, it As went the inside exits her, house. her house and walks towards her car. It went inside her house, man. You let a shadow creep in. A white shadow creep this time. Or a mister. But it is, it is inside your house now. Oh, we can see no. some strange translucent shape charge out of the woods near her house and run right inside the front oh. door. Now, whatever this is, does not seem to be any kind of compression glitch. No. The woman in the video is perfectly clear. And also, the figure approaches the light and still remains an odd, indistinguishable mist. What but the is heck? Is it supernatural? And if not, just what is this? As always, I leave it up to you to decide. What do you guys think? Isn't that weird? Jerry. Hey, Jerry. After three years of living a happy, peaceful life in their apartment in the United Arab Emirates, Zark, his wife, and son suddenly begin to experience terrifying, unexplained activity. Shh. The 
Let me just check. I think I've seen this one before. Have I? I'm not sure. Have we seen this? Besides what? hearing knocking, banging, and scratching, the family has a truly bizarre scare when one day they inexplicably. His reaction was legit. He was scared to f out, man. Find maggots all over their apartment. What? Zark explains that he's a skeptic, but that he's become increasingly more alarmed by his son's unusual behavior. The young boy claims he sees someone named, quote, Jerry. See dead people. I seen that movie? It's a good one. And that Jerry isn't always. If you know what movie I'm talking about, tell the others in the description. No, in the comment section. Friendly. Zark and his wife don't believe the boy at first, but when one day he complains about Jerry again, they decide to check their CCTV camera and are shocked by what they find. What? What? Needless to say, Zark and his wife now believe that Jerry might be something real after all. And whatever this presence is, it seems to become inc These videos are freaking me out, man. This is a good one. Good job, Nuke Top 5. Increasingly more aggressive. Yeah. What? Oh, are those around the house? Are those Kinder Buenos? If it is, those are good. What? Yeah. Objects around the house are moved and thrown, but nothing compares to what happens on another night while the family is fast asleep in bed. Oh. Zark is suddenly woken up by the unexplained sound of running water. Thank you. 
your water flowing? You have to get rid of that ghost man. I'm pretty sure it doesn't pay the water bill. Get that ghost out of there man. Running footsteps. Shit's going down in this place, man. Zark hears the sound of running water and discovers that both the faucet in the kitchen and the bathroom have mysteriously turned on by themselves. Zark then hears loud banging and the sound of someone running. Yeah. He then captures a strange, small, smoke-like figure oh. moving right in front of him. Yeah. Zark is freaked out by what he has just experienced, so he checks his CCTV footage to see if anything else was captured that night. When he rewinds his footage back to just before the running water woke him, he is shocked by what his CCTV captured. Check it out. Is it a child ghost? Is it Jerry? I don't see the ghost. Do you see the ghost? Holy mother of Jesus. Oh, I could see that. It is huge, man. His head is over up here, man. How tall are you? A tall, translucent what figure can be seen man? walking right beside a scooter that seems to move across the floor. Zark is now convinced that his apartment is haunted by something that he oh, now can't you're convinced? explain. Could this presence be what his son calls Jerry? Let me know what you think. Yeah. You can follow Zark's continuing paranormal story over on the YouTube channel, Zark Scary Haunting. I Thanks will. so much for watching. I'm still yeah. trying to get that upload schedule back on track. So please hit subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a video. Yeah, do it now. Those are some freakily spookily paranormal videos, man. Again tonight, I will not be able to sleep. Look how tired I look. I make these videos daily. I haven't slept for days, man. If that doesn't deserve a like and subscribe, then I don't know. Thank you all for watching. Until next time. Bye bye.